Top of the morning to you, laddies. Welcome back to Queen's Cones. Today we have a very special episode. We're gonna be doing the Shamrock Shake from McDonald's. Happy St. Patrick's Day, by the way. We're filming this all on the holy day itself. It's gonna be a good one. Without further ado, let's just jump right into it. We've got the beautiful, that was a bit Scottish. We've got the very own Shamrock Shake in its wee little glass right here in front of us. I won't do that the whole time. <laughs> my Irish, eh, my Scottish on the other hand, flawless, it's beautiful. This is not what it comes in. It comes in the ugly ass McDonald's cup that has no aesthetic value whatsoever. So I just poured it into this. We will be using the McDonald's straw, however, because that's how it was meant to be drank. Meant to be drunk, meant to be drankin', meant to be sipped on. We all know how I feel about mint things. I don't really like them. And I will say, kind of tastes like toothpaste. If, you're, if I'm being honest, I just want to be honest with you guys. So expectations going into this, not very high, but we'll give it a chance. Any Irishmen out there, I'm sorry I'm butchering your accent. I'm trying my best. So let's insert the straw in. Give it a nice suckle. The packaging is a one out of five. You guys know what the McDonald's cups look like. They're just, they're pretty ugly. So one out of five for packaging. This is very viscous. I, oh my God, God damn. Whew. Let's do it, the shamrock shake. I don't think this is very good. I don't like mint stuff, for the most part. Some of it's tolerable. With mint ice cream, it's ice cream. It feels like ice cream. So the toothpaste comparison is kind of just for the memes when it comes to that. But this is very much the consistency of toothpaste. And that's all I, I just felt like I stuck a straw in my, my tube of, of Crest Ultra White Oral Care. <coughs> first, first bite. First drink, first, this is the first milkshake on the show, by the way. First bite is like a, a two out of five. I can see the appeal if you like mint, but I don't know, this this will not be finished. This will be going down the drain. <laughs> two out of five for the first bite. It, it does, like it's not the worst thing in the world, so it doesn't get a one, but it's just a little above a one, so it's gonna be a two out of five for the first bite. Now in terms of texture, it's very goopy, very viscous, very, no, very gobby, if you uh, know what I mean. It's just very dense. Like, I feel like if I held this upside down, it would slowly pour out. It wouldn't like fall out instantly like water. It's just, it's a, mil it's a milkshake. It's gonna be a three out of five. Nothing too special, but not too horrible. So in terms of aftertaste, this is where I have a problem. McDonald's milkshakes. I haven't had any on the show because I've been avoiding them but they, it, it's almost like there's this chemically aftertaste that lingers in the top of your throat. It like buys a property up in the top of your, your throat and just lives there for the next hour and a half. And I feel it. It's got that same McDonald's milkshake tinge to it. Almost like we're, we're like eating sewage almost or some sort of radioactive goop. The aftertaste, again, it's gonna be like a two out of five. If you like mint, it's not gonna be as offensive as I'm finding it right now, but it's, uh, it's not the best, it's not the best. So in terms of wow factor, nothing too crazy. It's gonna, again, be a two out of five. It wasn't really good, wasn't really bad. It just, it was kind of what I expected, kind of toothpastey grossness. <laughs> If you're into that, you'll like it, but I don't know. Two out of five for wow factor just wasn't for me. So one word to describe the McDonald's shamrock shake would have to be, I was gonna say offensive, but it's, it's not that bad. <laughs> um, goopy, I'll say. It's very goopy. It's very Shrek swampy, which fun fact, they actually did have a promotional milkshake for Shrek the Third, when that came out, it was the, it was something swamp, swamp something. It was like mint milkshake with chocolate bits in it. If I if I'm remembering correctly, it was a long time ago, like ten years ago now, maybe even more. 
but they did have a Shrek thing. So they know that this is ogry by nature. And <laughs> it's very ogry and swampy. So I mean, I'm gonna have to go with goopy for the word to describe. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful St. Patrick's Day. Live it up to the fullest. It's a beautiful day out today, especially here in Canada. So hopefully, what are you living? It's good too. So be sure to hit the like button down below. Subscribe if you don't wanna miss any of this epic Quinn's Cones content every week. Every week. Except for weeks I don't feel like doing it. <laughs> if you have anything to say, criticisms, praise, put it down in the comments below. I love reading them, especially when I can't sleep at night. It's my go-to, just rereading old comments or new ones. It's fun, it's fun, it's fun, it's fun, it's fun. And be sure to join the Discord that's down in the description. There's some fun stuff that goes on over there. Lots of pictures of ice cream being shared and just good times being had. So be sure to check that out. It's really cool. This is also one of my favorite Quinn's Cones looks. I will admit, <laughs> Irish. It's, it's very good. So thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. Stay safe, take care, and may the luck of the Irish be with you.